Hey guys, the air conditioner here, because why not? Welcome back to some more of... I'm in the same area I said I was gonna... Basically... Uh, well, like, as you can see, it's like morning and all that. Basically, as you can tell, a lot of time has passed. I went... I believe I said I was going to, uh... Either check out the raptors or head that way, and... I headed that way, got lost, and eventually came back here, and... Now it's morning, and everything's all nice and sunny. I, I believe it was nighttime last time. I don't even remember. It was like... Hours or... What feels like years ago, and... I think I'm actually being stalked by that Rex. The, the green one over there, he's trying to be sneaky. I came back in over here, and I'm kind of learning this map a little bit. Oh, oh my god, it's a little baby Diablo. Hello. Okay. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. Do we seriously have a little baby Diablo now? Wait, is this like recreating the whole story from before? With the uh, Diablo and the Rexes or something? Because... I'm seeing a Karna over there. Karna over there. Well, that one's a, a Karna with uh, his friend Shanto or whatever's going up down there. And I, yeah, I'm willing to bet money. That Rex is stalking me. And these big guys, they're trying to keep order here. They're like, all right, we don't want no carnivores. He's like, you get out of here, you. Oh, God, I've been, like, wandering around for hours. But I managed to get all my uh, health and stuff. Oh, wait, actually, I need water. Alright, let's just get some water real quick, and then we should be good to go, and... I don't know what we should do about that wreck. Should we make it look like we're all like, yeah, we don't know you're there, and then, uh... Kind of see what goes down there? Alright. Those guys seem friendly enough. Oh god, he's right next to me. Every fire of my being is screaming, kill it, but... I don't want to invoke the wrath of the, uh, Shanto there, because... Shanto could do a lot of damage. Alright. I'm seeing another Karna here. I think this one I can be uh, more than allowed to... Uh... Whoa! Oh, he's going straight in! Oh, and the Rex is going in, I think. Yeah, let's make it look like we don't know the Rex is there. Or maybe he's a friendly Rex and he's just trying to... Uh... Hmm... Yeah, he's doing his victory screech. Whoa! Hey! I saw you kill my little Diablo! How dare you! I loved him! How dare you! Get out of here, you! Alright, so apparently this Karno is evil. Alright, I got you. Alright, so we have a bunch of bad eggs trying to spoil the bunch or whatever it is oh my god I can't believe you killed my little Diablo and I as you can probably already tell I turn off the chat and all that cuz everyone's just kind of screaming and everything like that well not really screaming but you know it's just a whole bunch of chatter and you know I'd much rather be able to see the bottom left part of my screen alright so that Rex is somewhere which kind of concerns me and thirst we're pretty good on we just need hunger now and if that Rex is... Oh, I didn't even see him. Wow, their green skin is just perfect. Especially with the whole name tags gone. Like, I'd actually see his name tag if I was right here. So let's actually open up a little bit of a clearing, because that's what keeps us alive in situations like this, where you have to maybe fight a Rex in the, the woods. Oh, no. Yeah, he's gone. I don't even see him. Oh, I, I love that and hate it at the same time. I love it because it's like, oh, cool. He's able to blend into the environment. And I hate it because, like, I'm the prey. So there's all that. Alright, where is he? Actually, yeah, I actually don't see him. And if we see that brown shant come back, we need to... We need to be cautious and maybe even kill him because he killed my little Diablo. Actually, wait, let's turn the chat back on. Maybe the Diablo actually joined in. Kill the Diablo... Th hmm. Apparently, the Diablo killed a carnivore. I didn't see that, but whatever. Well, see, there. I guess you could say now I'm the bad guy for killing someone who killed... I, I don't know. Regardless, there's a Karna over here. Huh. Did that Stego just drop dead, or did the Karna get him? No, wait, no, that's, that's a Diablo. Alright. I see you, Mr. Rex. Let's pretend that I don't, though. Okay. 
No, the Rex is just minding his own business. I think he's more of like, alright, I got meat here. I'm good. Maybe. If he goes past the body, then we have reason to be concerned. Nope, yep, he's trying to eat it. I think. Or maybe he's like, I like the fresh meat more. Nope, yep, he's eating it. Alright. Well, what we're gonna go do over here is... Jeez, we've been in, like, twins. Or I, I believe this is twins. I've heard a bunch of people calling it that in the chat and all that. Like, yeah, so... I've only... I only know about a few different lakes. I know this one, that weird tiny one, like... That I, for the life of me, don't know how to get back to. And then that really long stretch, which is actually Spawn Lake. Which, we'll have to get to that at some point. There's two Carnos there. I'm not liking that. Because Carnos, if they get behind you and they know to, you know, stop short when you stop short, then you're kind of dead. Because that's like the only defense you have against those guys. Because of this big, meaty tail. Mmm. Make a whole bunch of barbecue ribs out of that, even though it's a tail. Barbecue tail, I guess you could call it. Mmm. Whoa. He's getting pretty close. Actually, no, he's, he's body cleaning of it. Whoa. Oh, okay. Alright. Also, we need to check our health, because we turned off the chat thing, so we can't see how bloody we are. Alright. I'm watching you, Karno. I gotta watch that big guy, too. Because I don't know who he... I honestly, I don't even know who that guy's side is on anymore. He, like, knows I'm talking about it. He's like, I'm just gonna stare at you for a minute. Alright, well, let's see here. We got Trike, Stego, and then Rex, and then Carno somewhere. Alright, this area is kind of getting a little too deadly for my liking. There's another Carno over there. But the thing is, like, I only know how to get to the spawn lake, which I guess you could say we could try going to. Hmm. Are they doing the friendly call? I don't remember. Wait, there's that Karno over there. He actually got a decent bite out of me. I could heal in, like by resting for a minute, which I think I'm going to, just to get 200 health. Which, you know what's crazy? I found out that the big guys, they actually have 10,000 or something health in total, and then they regen 2,000 health every, like, you know, like, say, every time I reach the certain, like, what, like, 30 second mark or whatever, and then, boom, I get 100 health, they get 2,000. It's insane. Jeez, so that, so, that, that Wait, let, let's see here. How much damage does a Rex bite do? I think it's like 600, 800, some crazy amount. Oh, there's another track over there. Oh, he's actually fighting the Karna. Ooh! Oh, we got him. He got him good. Oh. Alright. Alright, it's go time now. That's it. You angered the bull. The lone Shanta who really doesn't have any, uh, you know, friend, well, not really friendly, more of, alright. Alright, I got him. We got him good. Okay, what's our health at? Alright, not that bad. Okay, well, we got rid of the angry little Karno, and we should be good to go back to that little spot there, and maybe meet up with that other trike, and I guess you could say we're kind of forming a herd, even though it's like... Wait, would that be considered a herd if it's like... Well, no, not herd. Obviously, it would be if it's like there's a whole bunch of different guys or something. But would I still be considered a lone Shanto, even though I'm traveling with different species? These are the questions that must be answered. Alright, so. Our health and all that is decently fine. There's another trike. I think he's doing the help me call. So I'm going to do my broadcast just to let him know there's some form of herbivore over here. Or maybe he's being chased by the big guys. Oh, and the other trike's gone. Well, it's just me and the stego now. Alright. Alright, so, there we go. We're at 2,100 health, and I see a Carno coming in. Oh, God, I think... I think that guy's doing his, uh, help me calls, and it's just drawing in the carnivores. That's, that's how it should be, like, doing your help me calls, and then they come out of the bushes, and then game over. No, I think he's actually... I think he's going for the car now. Hmm. No, it doesn't look like it. Alright, so I'm gonna assume that... Oh, I didn't see that little raptor there. B 
Yeah, I'm gonna assume that my healing is gonna take a little bit, so I might just sit here and do nothing for a spell, so we don't need to worry about health and... Okay, that's actually an aggressive Karno, because he's actually going after a little raptor. But I'm still gonna heal if I can. If I see him coming directly towards me, like so. Check my health. Okay. I'm not gonna go after him. Like, I'm gonna show, like, this tree line. I just pointed with my finger. You can't see that. Yeah, like this tree line here. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, that, this is like my turf. Like, that's kind of what I do with, uh, I believe I said that in the last set. I'm all, like, confused now. Now that, like, with, uh, I'm gonna be trying it all realistic and all that, where basically it's like, I'm gonna have, like, kind of a, like, a, a personal space bubble. You enter that, or you get near it. Like, the personal space bubble is gonna have its own personal space bubble, where if you enter that, then you're gonna get a whole bunch of, like, angry snorts and all that. You get within that, I'm gonna charge you, but not go for the immediate kill, unless I know that you're gonna go fight back. The whole point is to try and scare him off, because you don't wanna, you know, risk fighting and all that. But regardless, let's just lay down here. I'm not seeing those two guys. He's probably still chasing the raptor. If that little thing I'm seeing moving... No, that's... No, wait, is that the raptor? That is! I don't know if you can really see it. He's in, like, the top left right there. Just kind of, like, laying there. I don't know what those two big guys are doing. Oh, the other guy over there has a nice little trike friend. Alright. So once we get a little bit more health, I guess me and my little stego friend here are... Oh, that's a galley! Alright, so we're kind of forming a herd without even really trying. <laughs> what are the odds of that? And I think what we'll do is we'll try and head to Spawn Lake. I kind of know the, like, way to get there. And that usually has a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, that could be pretty cool. And I do see that Karn over there who's going for the raptor. Who's now running to us for Sanctuary. Alright. I see you. He re- Oh, he got the raptor. Jeez, he must have been starving. He really wants that meat. I mean, I'm not gonna go chase him down right now. Like, that's what- Like, apparently the- Like, I think it's like the kill chance, or- Forget what the term for him is. Like, the aggro chance. That they basically- They see- So much to see a carnivore, they chase him down. I'm not doing that, because that can- easily backfire if they get behind you. Alright, I'm watching that guy. He's in the trees there. Oh, wait. Wait, did he get the raptor? No, I think he did, or that's another one? I really don't know, but these guys are just kind of splashing around in the water. I wonder how, like, the whole, like, crocodile situation with one of these big guys is gonna work out. Are they gonna be, like, attacking their legs, or something? But he's also doing his tail whip, so I don't know if he's, like, going aggro mode on the car now, or us. No, no, it looks like he's... Alright, so these guys are basically patrolling the this twins and keeping out all the carnivores. Alright, so they're, like, kind of giant police officers with their baton being a huge, what is that, like, 30-foot tail or some crazy thing? Something like that. All right, so we have 90 hunger, 90 thirst. We're, we're good for some time, but as you can see, it takes a tad bit to actually heal. Hello. That always scares me when they're, like, coming towards you. He's like, you have your space, I have mine. Why are you coming to mine? Ah, oh, it's, it's scary, yet you know that they're somewhat friendly. Like, 75% of the time, these big guys are friendly. All right, where'd that Carno go? Hmm. Not seeing him, but yeah, I, apparently they're also going to be adding like weight in the future, like AI fish, like not controlled, but like for stuff like spino and like di like water dinos, which I can imagine this lake here. It, well, if they keep this map or whatever, like basically in the end game map, whatever they're going to end up doing, like they're probably going to have a whole bunch of fish, and then you'll see maybe spinos in the water and a whole bunch of really cool stuff. It'll like actually look like a whole ecosystem. It'll look really cool. I can just imagine it now. Then you got like the stuff waiting for like the cycle of when like. Chance or whatever. Oh. Hello, Rex. He's sneaking by, so I didn't even see him. Clever girl. If I didn't even look over there, I would not have even known there was one in the area. He's at... Oh, he's sitting and waiting. Alright. Well. There's that. But yeah, like, I can imagine where, like, you have huge Shant herds or, like, Shant plus a Myasaur, which is apparently the next herbivore being added or something, where, like, they're just, like, migrating in big groups and all that, going from lake to lake. Then you got the predators waiting and... How, how did they... Okay. Those guys climbed the mountain. There's no way they could have come from over there because I would have heard them. Whoa. 
Ooh, I got a nice hit on him. Oh, God. Oh, what? I didn't take damage? Oh, I oh, the Stego took the blow. Oh, my God. I love you, Stego. Oh, <gasps> there's a Dryo. It's a Dryo. What? Where, where are you running? Oh, he's dead. I give him the count of three. Three, two, yep. He is straight dead. He's being chased. Ah, oh, God. Damn, dry. Oh. Oh. Oh, he got got. Alright, you're coming within my safety bubble here, man. That's right. You get out of here, you. Stego, I would be a little cautious. I mean, he has, like, a lot more reason to be safe, because anything chasing him is getting his weapon. You have to hit him head on. Oh, my God. Look at that big guy. He's 100% under the water. What the heck? He is full blown under there. Okay. Just making sure that's not behind me. Only his nose is above the water. That is amazing. Alright. Well, I guess that's a good spot to end it for now. Because, wow, that's, uh, yeah. That's something. So, yeah. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. No cliffhangers today. If this guy's coming in, we're going to take him out. All right, no more cliffhangers. All right, hold on. Oh, oh, and he's dead. Well, there you go, no cliffhangers. And that, oh my God, he's full blown underwater when he drinks. All right, so anywho, yeah, like the, wait. No, oh, that was a different Carno. That was a different Carno. All right, unintentional cliffhanger, go. So yeah, like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I will see you next time.